Hello everyone, I'm Mr. Mocha Lover, and thank you for joining me back here in Old World Blues playing as a great new arena. But eventually by this episode we will become, hopefully at least, the Enclave. So the last time we took out the Yakuza territories, I think maybe it was the last time? Maybe, maybe not. The Antelope Tribes, I can't remember, bro. but right now we have the Klamath Veal and a few comments to get through. So, like I said, hopefully we'll be the Enclave by the end of this video, but let's taking down the Den Focus is what we're going to do next. The people of Klamath are, after all, quite primitive, and their town might be better served under others' rule. It would be a great asset for new Reno to acquire, after all, so we want to go to war with them. But right now, let's go ahead and start making a few more military factories, because I really want to emphasize all this stuff, but especially close air support. I really want a lot of close air support. Industrial fertilizer is also very good to have as well, though. That's, that's a little bit ahead of time. Totally fine. Whatever. Go ahead and train if you need to. Go ahead and train. That'd be kind of nice. Uh, we could honestly probably use maybe a few more divisions, maybe, before we go to war, but we'll see what happens. We got that going on. We'll do that one, too. We do need to save a little bit of manpower, so we're going to do this. Because taking over the Klamath will take a while to core that stuff. I do want to go to war with the Marrow Drinkers, which is going to take some time. And let's just say, hypothetically... I may or may not have played this twice already, and this is my third attempt at playing this particular episode. Let's just, hypothetically, of course. Hypothetically. Um, we could do no training. Time. Let's do this one first, and then we'll raise our conscription level. Because even though we have about 6,000 manpower now, that might not stay that way for a while. Let's just put it like that. Yeah, I really want more planes. I want a, a lot of planes. Like, good lord, I want a lot of planes. Only four a month? Jesus, that's not good. Please, let's get some more efficiency. Please, please, please. But regardless, hope you're having a great day. Let's get to some comments from yesterday. So, I asked you guys yesterday whether you guys use drugs. Well, even though that might not be the best way for me to phrase things, I wondered if you guys use stuff like Jet, Buff Out, Psycho. Because I established that I really don't use this too much, as you can probably tell. And I just bought some slaves. So you guys said, most of you guys really don't use drugs that often. You usually just buy guns, which is, you know, which is pretty much what I do sometimes. Uh, let's not sell any guns. We need some more of the Ghost Pecos Colony. So that was one of the comments. Another one is, play as a nation, any nation, but instead of conquering people, all you do is puppet them. That's really disgusting, High Chapel. I didn't realize this. That's really disgusting. But, play as in any nation and puppet everyone. Don't take them over. Well, puppet them. You don't actually annex them, though. Which sounds like quite the difficult thing to do, but let's go do Hordes of the North. So, north of Nevada is a cold and barren territory, full of savages and distant powerful threats. With the Antelope Reservation under our control, it's now our first time, or first line of defense against the Northern Hordes. Let's stop training and prepare to go to wall, in which we all try to do an encirclement first, which sounds like a lot of fun. Mm, go through here, 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 here. Actually, yeah, that's not a bad idea. You guys shift up north a little bit more. Right there. Bop, 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 bop. Buy things. Cool. Yeah. I don't know. We'll see what happens. I'm not against that idea, but I'm not particularly for that idea right now. So we'll see what happens. Let's go ahead and go to war. You we should be good. Uh, grab all you guys. Come through here. That shouldn't be too bad. Then get down there, and then just you make your way all the way over there. All of you guys just go straight that way. So one got to go that way. That's one. There you go. That's nice. And then we'll encircle these guys. Kill them all off. Have a good time. And eventually raise our conscription level because we're going to need to. Even though we're going to need some more infantry armor. Let's see, occupied territories. Oh, uh, there's no more resistance. Pacify them. Pacify them. Good, good, good. Lots of manpower for now, but that's not to probably stay that way. Ooh, they threw another militia division there. So be it. After this, we will raise conscription. After we do this, for more civilian factories, because I love civilian factories. Oh, and there goes the 80s and Eastport. The 80s are pretty much my arch rival in any campaign. They always somehow are very, become very incredibly strong, which I really do not like. But it is what it is. Cool. And hopefully this is where we get a lot more army XP because we could definitely use it. Come on, guys. Keep going. Keep going. Give me more army XP even though we get some advisor uh, stuff every day. Wow, we're actually getting one. Cool. Here we're getting just a little bit air XP. Oh, you actually are tired. Wow, that's not good. Not ideal. Profits from the drug trade? I think so. Alright, you guys are taking... Why do you take so long, man? 20 combat width? You disappointed me. Please don't disappoint me. Oh, what are we missing? Guns? We are missing guns. That's not good. Uh, come back over here. Do that. I'm not going to lower that. I don't mind lowering the dogs for now, though. Uh, do that for now, too. That's fine. Go down to three, then. That's fine. Share the wealth. Share the wealth. It seems pretty fitting that we use basic laser weaponry as well. So, 
Let's do that. You know what? Since we're out of guns, we got plenty of caps. How about we buy some guns? Thank you. I appreciate that. Ah, we can begin this scavenging program because we can. Another comment from yesterday, though, after we get this monoplane fighter and do this, which we're not going to upgrade them yet because they want more planes first. We're lacking a few planes at the moment. While wow, you are taking forever to do this. That is honestly a little pathetic. Move, move, move. Oh, did you actually get an upgrade, though? That's okay, then. Towards the north, you're going to become a local leader. Very good. Let's go ahead and do placing a bet. So the Antelope tribe is now under the sphere of Reno's influence and can be probably brought into the fold. Constructing settlements out there is risky, but it's a bet we are willing to take. Another comment is, someone said, play as the NCR, but, and this is a huge but. Actually, you guys come this way and go there. No, 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 no. Go this way. There you go. Like that. Uh, play as the NCR and play as the Enclave. That seems kind of difficult unless you want to play as, like, the Dayglow Enclave, I think, in, like, base Old World Blues, I think, or something like that. Something like that. I don't know. We'll see what happens. There's no guarantee for anything here. This is turning into a very disappointing attack. And this is why we need more manpower. Or manpower. Planes. Close air support. Yeah. Hmm. Why do you go that way? Just go this way. It doesn't make too much sense. Come on. Even more attack. Come on. They're not going to win against us, and we're going to win against them. Maybe here and there. Come on, man. I just want to do an encirclement. Is that too much to ask? Obviously it is. It obviously is. Good, go, 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 go. Help him out, help him out. And we have... Done it, go. Go. Nice, Scorched Earth, good. Awesome. Shock and all, yes please. And wrap up prototyping for even more goods? I think so. Let's get that one and we'll get some construction after this as well. Come on, take, take, destroy him, destroy him, destroy him. Oh, uh, yeah. Cool. Cool, cool, cool. And as per normal in my campaigns, what do you think would be a good intelligence agency name for the Enclave? Because we're not doing it right now, because we're still in Arena for now, but for the Enclave, what do you what do you think would be an appropriate name for us? Oh, look, they're all veterans now. That's good. And we've got a lot of army XP, which is delicious. We're still not making that many fighters. If we're not making any fighters, just go ahead and do this then. It, it, it doesn't even matter at this point then. Go do that one if you can. Come on, get in there before this one dies. Yay, we killed him off. I think. Maybe. Let's see what happens. Clamus is gone. Thank you. Cool. Uh, you guys next. And this time, I'm going to actually... We're going to do that. I'm going to have 30 divisions maybe guarding the line. Because I know that these guys actually have quite a bit of resistance here, so we'll see what happens. If we need to pull around some extra divisions to help hold the line in certain areas, that's fine, which is good. And we'll have some rat farms. Forty years ago, Klamath survived the invasion of rats, which practically captured the western part of the city. Then it all ended with the arrival of the Savage, who would later be remembered as the Chosen One. But many rats remain there, and meat is, well, meat. Mmm, we love meat. Uh, we love meat. Love it, love it, love it. Even if we don't put it in our mouth... I don't know. We'll see what happens. How much infantry equipment do we have? Infantry armor looking pretty good. There we go. We should have enough for that. Pacification, pacification, sporadic outposts. Good. And you guys, just in case things get like really bad over here, go and hang out right there. Yeah, look at that. 70%. Uh, but it's going down. That's good. How much manpower do they have? Ah, yeah, it's passed me a hit. Zero. Basically, it's a weaponry. Good. Uh, let's come down here and actually get some better dogs so we can help put down enemies more. Reclamation authority, very good. What do we have here? Ah, oh, yeah, do that. It's fine. So we're missing planes, of course. That's pretty much it. Nice. Infantry force, you have that. We gotta get some chem companies on you guys. Uh, throw in the anti tank. We definitely need some anti tank. Doggos would be pretty nice as well. Enclave, we're gonna duplicate this division. Biggies. Nice. But now we obviously have no army XP, but eventually we will. Nothing there. That's fine. Uh, let's see. Research speed. Let's go with research speed next. Need more manpower. Scavenge for stuff with our power armor. And infantry equipment is looking pretty good. So let's go ahead and instead sell some updated equipment. Even though we don't need the caps, the main thing I'm re selling this stuff for is to have better relations with the family that deals with the gun market. Hopefully these guys will attack us. If not, then we can shift some lines around, that's fine. 
I really want them to attack me. But that might not happen. Only three divisions. I could make more, but I want biggies. Train one more. You could probably use them. Nice. Some big boys. Even more drugs. I love the drugs. I love the drugs, yes. Actually, ooh, rat farm's good. Let's do take that township. With a new power over Klamath Consolidated, we can claim the town as our rightful territory and work on bringing it under direct control from New Reno. Love it. Actually, how big are you for combat with? You are two, and you are two. So if I do this, it's two and a half. Yeah, they're the exact same combat with. I wish you could cheat it a little bit. That's okay, though. Oh, we're getting some anti tank. Anti tank. Yeah, we're working on it. Good, keep making more stuff. Keep making more factories. That is going to be great. Eventually, we will need to go to war with the 80s. We will need to go to war with other people. But that's okay. You guys have training. See what happens when they attack us. And do that too. I told you to stop it. I don't understand why. It says right click delete all orders. That's obviously a lie. Cool. Let's go and see what happens. Are they attacking us at all? No. Okay then. Well, shift our lines around then. We're not going to attack them too harshly yet. I do, though, want to encircle a group or two. Even if it's only a single division. Cool. And we can take our time, that's fine. There's no rush with this stuff. I don't want to be careful. Like I said earlier, this is my third time doing it, so I want to be careful. <laughs> Alright, let's see. Anything here? We could do this again. Might as well. Faster just by Wargol's times. Cool. Do that and do that. They should not be able to pierce us. Grant us for his company. What can we? What we could really use on our divisions is recon. Even though we've got one from the dogs, we could honestly use more recon. We'll get that once we get this construction stuff done. Maybe after shock and all. That would probably be a good thing to do. Better doggos? Yes, please. And we don't want to take stuff too quickly because we only have so much infantry armor, so. Good. Help them out. So we can destroy this one division. Hit him even harder. Uh, you guys can actually just kind of hang out. Go, good, 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 good. And once we have them, we can actually save up on like five, six divisions here. Beautiful. Be nice and smart about it. It's always good to be smart about things. Usually. I don't know if there's ever a case where it's not good to be smart about things. I really don't know. Over here we go one, two, three. Yeah, that's not bad. Really want to destroy their... Uh, line, so it's easy for us to do this. There you go. Something like that. And we've got time, so. And I really want to build up our industry. That's the main goal here. Industry, industry, industry. Cool. And we already did this. Well equipped army. Ooh, every cap of the army. I don't want to do this. I never choose everyone for the board machine because I don't want to lose population. Population is so necessary, it's not even funny. And now we have this done. Let's do City of Sins. No, we're not at peace. We can't do that. So we're going to come over here and do the Cat's Paw. Cat's Paw Bordel is the main of all new Reno brothels and the most famous one north of Gamora. Even though it's not for nothing that it offers paradise pleasure for every mm -mm, taste. I hope they have Fisto there. As some would say, taste is too perverse, though. Man, this institution, though, brings fabulous money. And if you invest in it, this money will be mm -mm, beaten off. Uh, I don't know if I would exactly choose that description when talking about money and stuff like that, but you know what? If you want to beat off your money, go right ahead. It's not my money. Hopefully, I won't touch it. Cool. Oh, yes! Yes, military factory is great. Throw them right there. Throw them out there. We're going to need anti-tank rifles for where we're going. Trust me. Oh, they were attacked? Come on, man. What type of garbage is that? Good. Help them out. Uh, I'm actually going to send you half of you guys this way, too. And you're going to come that way, too. Really want to be careful. Oh, Heaven's getting High Chapel. Very nice. Very nice. Keep moving up. Uh, no, you're going to go this way, actually. Oh, it's paused. I paused it. My bad. Come on. Oh, don't let him move. And three, two. Come on. Get your butts over there. Nice. A small encirclement. Actually, that's not bad. You guys can just go that way, and then you just... The Granite's first company, just go that way. Beautiful. They're not attacking me anywhere else. That's fine. They've lost 740. We've lost 9. Are they getting more... If, what was it? Breaking the corpses? Cool. Hey! A small little encirclement is always welcome here. Cool. 
really just do that if you guys have about to. Stretch out their lines just a little bit so they can't garrison everything. Good. Uh, just do that as well, just because I want to make sure that we have enough soldiers for the future. Help the attack as well. There you go. Nice. Stretching them out. I like it. Miniature circuitry. Good. Got some reinforcements right too. Come on, man. Yeah, this is why we need more planes, because the attack is just so low right now. We better restore printing. So, of course, the cat's paw is not just a brothel. Once there was a printing press or printing house that published the famous erotic magazine. Of course, now only a few copies are left of him that survived from two centuries ago. But we can well restore the printing house and reissue the magazine. Yes, if there's money to be made, especially if it's erotic money, we can do it. <laughs> that actually has more meanings than just one if you say we can do it. Mm. Didn't think about it when I said it like that. Good. And you know what? If they're lowering resistance, that just means less resistance that we have to take out later. And I'm totally okay with that. Alright, so. Oh, NCR was pretty violent. That's okay with me. Next up, where's a good place for an encirclement? Over here. We could probably come here, there, to there. So it's a small one. Actually, we just go there to there. That's a small encirclement, but you know what? That's okay with me. And then we could do probably a general attack if we, if we really, really wanted to. Plane-wise, we're doing better. We're doing better on planes, we're doing better on close air support. Or fighters, I should say. Nice, doing a lot better, a lot better. Build, 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 build. Nice, we have two full sets going at the same time. Love it. Power on our scavengers. You know what, how about with the research speed? That'd be good. Research faster, 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 faster. We have to go faster, like in Red Flood. Faster, faster, faster. Go ahead, help them out. And then go that way. One division, go there. And both of you guys can help out there. There you go, not bad. Get ready to move. And boom. It's only one division that's really gonna you know, do anything here, but it's only one division that we destroy, but that's okay. Cool, we're still printing, and then we shall do sombrero repair. Desperado was never as big as the Shark Casino, but it still remained a very vicious place. With death of the Mordino family, of course, casino empties, the casino is empty, and it would have to be restored to make Reno the capital of gambling business north of Vegas once again. And I like this. I really like this. They're done. They're dead. Beautiful. Just beautiful. I know I'm taking quite a while to do this, too, though. It's alright, this video will be a little longer, as you can tell, because of this. Mm, one, two. Same thing right here. Pop, pop. Plus 36 versus 1,000. They have 21 to 30 divisions. That's f Ooh. What did you guys do here? What is going on? Mexico's killing itself, which is fine with me. Oh, do you have an upgrade? Uh, kind of. You know what? I'm going to go with entrenchment speed and more entrenchment because this infantry needs it. Trust me. Really trust me on this. Whew. Bricks? I love bricks, especially when you throw them at your enemies. Fire teams, now we good. Almost ready to make some thicky boys. Some biggie thickies. Mm, we're not quite advanced yet. We will get there, though. I promise you that. Uh, eh, frag grenades, why not? Seems like the Enclave would probably use frag grenades over uh, flamers, so that's probably why I'm doing that. So, help them out. Recon companies would be so nice to have. Oh my goodness. Better dogs, go ahead, that's fine. Still, it's only one more division we're going to kill off, but that's okay. Nice. Oh, right, there goes their organization. And they are ready to die. Time to die, time to die, time to die. Even though that seems like a kind of generic thing that villains would say, I'm thinking of a certain video game that says, Time to die. From the PlayStation 2 era. What villain or what game is that from? From the PS2 era, if you know. It's time to die, time to die. It's about the middle of the game where you fight a villain like that who says that, even though you're following her on a frozen planet. Hmm, what game is that from? Hmm. Even though that game's actually pretty old by now. It's one of the games I grew up playing. But, you know what? If I remember, if someone re reminds me in the comments, I'll let you know the title of that game uh, in the next video. Because I'm not going to remember by the time tomorrow hits. Woo! I'm not going to remember anything by the time the next video comes out. I go through so many campaigns. Woo! That's fine. Come over here, destroy two more divisions, and then we'll do a general attack. We should do okay-ish with a general attack. I guess how about... This time, we went for two divisions. Cool, cool, cool. 
Awesome. And take him out. 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 Good. Okay, you did it before we... Okay, good. Nice. Beautiful. Beautiful. Another bloodbath in Mexico. No one gives a crap about that because we are currently in Nevada. Alright, so for this group... Uh, hmm. It seems like they're actually stacking their border a little bit more efficiently now. Hmm. Here we go. Well, we need two more divisions first. That's fine. Because we really do just need to spend more time building up our industry. That's literally what I'm just waiting here for. And we didn't have to do that, but that's fine. Good. Alright, power armor. Four divisions. Take one off. There you go. There you go. Oh, and there goes Arroyo. Cool. And then, boom. Help him out. Cool. Sombrero repair. Oh, and it looks like they turned into Gorgonia. Or however you pronounce it. Nice. Very nice. And let us do medicine production. Mordino, 4th century, engaged in production of drugs in large quantities. Now Mordino has disappeared, but the weak workers and notes remained. And when, with them, we can very well expand production of medicines that are in demand in the wasteland. It could bode massive profits. Huge profits. Yeah, after this, we're going to definitely attack on the entire front. Cool. And you're in. You're from the line. Good. Please come here. And you guys are going to go do that. going to go straight that direction. Get you on the front. Three. Uh, actually, that's it's not first. We should have enough planes now. Three, two, good enough. Go ahead. We'll give them a little bit of a, an advantage first. Go ahead. And then we'll do this. Go. Good. Now, we're not going to win everywhere, but by destroying a lot of their divisions beforehand, they are definitely weaker. And that's a great, great thing. Magic tank, that's good. What do we need? More anti-tank? Well, we're working on it. We're working on it for sure. More planes. Good, good, good. Yeah, we're definitely going to be struggling here. That's why I raised my conscription level a little earlier. Ah, the return triumphant. Poseidon energy schematics. Nice. Nice. Hopefully we, this gave us enough time to build... Oh, that's not good enough. Hmm. Can you guys go that way, help them out, and destroy that one division here? You might be able to. Come on. Even if we don't win here, that's fine for now. Look how... This is why I said the infantry is very weak. And that's why I'm spending so much time with Gorgonia. Because I really don't want to lose that many divisions. The infantry is just not that strong. Especially with the land doctrine that we chose. It's pretty darn weak in my opinion. Oh, and before we get too far... We gotta do this too. Pacification, we gotta just eradicate him. Pacification, down here. Yeah, as much as I like, I like the apostles, eradicate any resistance. That'd be good. Uh, sure, operational security, and then better dynamite. Stronger dynamite. Good dynamite. If you can do that, that'd be great. Aw, oh, they got through. That sucks. Alright, seems like we're winning. We've got 50 infantry divisions. We've got a couple guys here. Do you have anything for us? Nothing really interesting at all. Melee hacker, sure. Even though you shouldn't be using your power armor with melee equipment, but whatever. No, cool. Uh, you know what? Here's a strategy. Do that and do that. Then. Don't go for the capital. Literally just take everything around the capital so everyone else starves for supplies. 80s declare on the Sky Reavers. Very good. Please don't take the capital. Please don't take the capital. Do that, and then just take all this stuff. Go for the victory points. Because everyone should be starving for supplies now. Or, for the most part, it's not going to be perfect. No, don't get it, don't get it. I'm telling you, don't get it so everyone else can starve for supplies. NCR in the rapids. Alright, no, 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 don't be tempted. Nope, don't be tempted. No. Because this way, it's... it's Definitely gonna weaken them if they actually get if they don't get this area. Look at that. Even though we're not winning on that one red one for 75. God dang it, you pieces of garbage. I can't click fast enough to get rid of that. 
come up to there and go up to there, and then we're gonna do Golden Go Globes. So Corsican Brothers created not only a porno studio in the post-apocalyptic world, products of which imme immediately gained immense popularity. Sex has always been in demand, and it helps to keep people in control. So the studio will be in will be for us not only as an income tool, but as a way to control the city. Yes, control their vices. Gnosis? No, that's Python. Do we have Gnosis? We do have Gnosis. That's good. And we're pretty close to capitulating them. But we, oh my gosh, look at that infantry armor and infantry equipment. Well, time to buy some more. We can spend the caps for that, that's good. Hmm, anything else here? We can buy LMGs, but we don't really need to yet. Radar? Sure. We got a way to go to war then, help settlements, that'd be nice. Good. Agricultural stuff, we can kind of wait, we don't need actually any more supplies, which is kind of surprising. Got some more goodness coming. Since we're doing two civilian factories, we'll do two. There you go, right there. We'll do one, we'll do two, we'll do one, and then we'll do another two. That'll be nice. Can we course something else now? Uh, Paradise Valley, actually, that wouldn't be too bad. We need 200 political power, though. That's not bad. Side channel attack. I got a couple extra divisions. Good. Uh, I'm going to grab more resource efficiency gain for now. We will might need that in the future. Maybe. Archeron, Acheron, something like that. I don't know. We could raise our conscription up again, but once we get all this uh, stuff pacified, we should do pretty okay. Pass pacification, eradication, eradication, eradication. That's good. We need more dogs, too. Whew. We need more factories just in general. Jesus. Yeah, do that, too. We make plenty of guns a day. Good, kill them off. We got tons of army XP though, and that is really quite a rewarding. Cool. Thank you. There we go. So we gotta spend some time putting these things down. Building or wasteland. Cool. And just in case anything goes poorly here. No, no, don't do that. Floating globes. Very good. Let's do this. City of Sin. So, New Reno has always been an independent city and it will remain so in the future. We do not intervene in conflicts because, or between the giants of the wasteland, but we will remain aloof from the, such nonsense. The NCR is too stupid to attack us. Until then, of course, we can enjoy our independence. So what we're going to do is we're going to stack up here. And what we're going to do is, uh, focus fire. Yes. We're going to stack up around here. Because you never know if, uh... A certain nation is going to attack us if when we become a different nation. Wink, wink, nudge, nudge. I would played this one a little earlier, so I know exactly what's going to happen. And if that's the case, go and train two. Yeah. Uh, yeah, you guys would probably stay right here so we can pierce their lines. Uh, not... Uh, nah, nah, I don't want that one. Operational security, very good. What we need, though, is just time to build ourselves up and make sure that we don't have a deficit of anything. Yeah, that can wait a little bit. Um, common energy weapons, and maybe some, some, some other equipment next. Four is not bad. Let's get some bigger biggies. Do we need that one? We already have... Good. It's great. Because now I'm switching you guys over. We don't need this low ball stuff. Nope. No siree. And for you guys, 23, switch to militia. Pacification. Oh no, eradication. Pacification. And once we're below 30%, then we'll switch things around. <laughs> 26, eradication. That's fine. Pacify them. And there goes our manpower. See? That's why I raised my manpower earlier. Uh, do that one. Which one do we want? Paradise Valley, I think. It's not going to help us that much. Oh, down here. Gives us almost 900 more manpower. Which we use half immediately for garrisons, which is okay. Which is okay. Alright, so we got enough infantry armor now. Infantry equipment's, infantry equipment's not bad. We do need more doggos, though. Not bad. Keep you guys like that for now. We're going to need some more of this. Yeah. We're going to need a lot of things. We're going to need a ton of things, but we have about a thousand manpower, that's not too bad. And we've got to course some things, so we got like one more factory or two, maybe. Which is always very nice. And there goes our Sky Reavers, I hate the 80s, like I normally say, but that's okay. And we're doing City of Sins, so we get some more, uh, more support and stability, which is actually really, really nice. Oh, we're missing our doggos. Please. Please. Donate today. Save our doggies. More divisions, good. 
Do we have any extra planes? No, we might actually. Oh, wow, we actually do have a few extra planes. What a rare occurrence. Do we have any gliders? Cool. It is only 2280, so that's fine. Do that. Thank you. Hang out, train. Make yourselves better. Oh, the Brotherhood. We're going to take them on eventually. Provide power armor. Uh, do with the vehicles then. That's fine. Uh, do we need more guns right now? No. We have about 31,000, so we could probably sell some all today. So, oh, fire teams. Support equipment, fire team. That's not bad. City of Sin. Let's do create the Nevada back. So, with the NCR, we are, we are not in their way. But at the same time, it must be recognized that we are no longer independently existing. Or something like that. Not at a time when such giants as, such as the NCR and Legion are fighting. Therefore, we must take a closer look at the idea of the Nevada Pact. A military alliance between the most developed communities of the Wasteland, even though, at this point, we've taken out anyone that would really want to be allied with us. So, yeah. Hey, look. Any more power armor? Yeah, I like the biggies. Oh, you know what? Do we have logistic companies? Yeah, we might just throw this on. It's going to ruin the armor just a little bit, but it'll be worth it for that group. It really will be. Infantry... Uh, we already have one recon. I think having more recon would be beneficial. Yeah, I love recon so much. It's one of my favorite support companies. I just don't ever go a campaign without it um, if I can afford it. Because it's so good. Makes in my mind, it's so good. Uh, any upgrades? No. Any upgrades for you guys? No, and that's fine with me. Agricultural experts, we don't really need them right now. How is this looking? Eradication? Good. You're below 30. Platoon training? Good. Radio detection? Good, 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 and let's do some of this too. So we can start doing some of the uh, other special doctrine stuff. Pacify everyone. Plenty of manpower now. Pacification, pass, pass. Eradication, good. Eradication, good. We have er eradicated a lot of resistance. <sighs> Which makes it so much better. So much more tolerable. 500 some extra infantry armor. North Coover taking in a raid. Which we don't have enough here to do that yet, which is fine. Plain stuff. Let's grab some of that there. Thank you very much. Mexico's on fire, which is fine with me. I really don't care about Mexico right now. Riders, good. 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 That should be enough. And there goes Arroyo. Which is fine. Good. Train, train, train if you need it. Give me more army XP. We still need more doggos, which is fine. Power armor is always going to be needed more, 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 more. Do we have another division? Yes, we do. Good. And, oh, Sergeant Granite. Oh. As much as I like this, eh, this person is inspirational. This person is inspirational, so maybe we won't get rid of them yet. I'll do something like that. Common energy weapons. Nice. That's still ahead of time. I can do grenade rifles. That's fine. Good. Uh, I'm not sure. Hrafnkel. That is a weird way to say stuff. Uh, reconnaissance. Sniper. Oh, I'll do, we'll do sniper. Why not? Night person. Scavenger's Triumph. Nice. A bonus to robotics. Lovely. Absolutely lovely. You guys are all done doing your stuff. The infantry, not looking too bad. It's still not superb, but it'll, it'll work for now. Cool. Nevada Pact. Awesome. Now, we could become the Enclave, but let's do something else first. Let's grab another research slot. Maybe growth and base? Let's do that one. So, the ends justify the means, and sweatshop labor is ultimately extremely efficient. There are wasters and junkies who would rather die on the streets, at least this way, they're employed. Which is a good thing, and we just became a major power in the wasteland, which is awesome. And I know I'm taking a while with this episode, it's just because we have to. We just have to take our time with this. I'm gonna do four for now, even though we do want more anti-tank on everything. Am I missing something here? Why is this highlighted? Hmm. Manpower slowly going up. Pacify them, pacify them. We should be able to pacify them all now. Good. Well, we're close. We were very close. That's alright, though. And we're training our soldiers so that they're very, very good. Just one there. Just one there as well. You guys are actually looking pretty darn tanky, and I love it. Cool. And... Go right there. Nice. So we don't have to deal with that for now. Now, why am I guarding this group? Why am I guarding against these folks? Like, it doesn't make any sense, right? Well, it makes perfect sense, because once we become the Enclave, then these guys will probably attack us. That's why I'm not attacking them or doing anything else just yet. Ooh. Oh, yeah, we got this one. 
power stations? Not bad. Electronics, that's not bad either. Cool. But I love switch up labor. Cool. I thought we got it. Nope. And let us do, go ahead and do Enclave Technician next. So, and to this military council, we should we could add a local former member of the Enclave whose first-hand knowledge of their advanced technology and their pre-war tactics could be invaluable. Absolutely. And look at this. Faction map mode, Nevada Pact, NCR, Western Brotherhood, Children of the Gates. Good stuff, my friends. Get more monoplane attackers. Okay, look at this high chapel. Good. Throw you right there next. Good. Now, 30 divisions running against these guys probably is not going to be easy. Yeah. Just in case, where is this? I'm doing this because we have to. I do it out of love. Yeah, I'll say it out of love. Yeah, sure. And just in case, just level one step. Oh, actually, that's level. That's a, that's really concentration. A big concentration of forts. Go and do that. As we're building up at least one more thing of civilian factories. I love civilian factories. We're about to get paid. Uh, we don't really need to buy any more. We have a thousand slaves. I really wish we could get more slaves. I really, really wish we could. Other than power armor and planes, we're doing pretty darn well. Engine advancements. Let's go and do that. That's fine. And once we, be we become the Enclave, we will get... In uh, we, we will become advanced. My brain just like went, nope. Oh, we're going to do every cap for the army too. Even Mole Factory knows. Nice. I don't think the Brotherhood will actually be able to push us through here, because they don't look that strong, for the most part. Their power armor might be really strong, but... Oh, look at that. It takes, it's pretty quick doing this. March 4th. Good. Yeah, I'm just worried about these guys down here. These guys could be pretty darn evil towards us. Basic drill would be good. More recovery rate is always welcome. Grab that next one. And grenade rifles, please. Thank you. And there goes Nueva Atlan. Go over here. Hmm. Rocket launchers. Oops. Wrong, wrong thing. Yeah, that's the one we wanted, I think. Good. Power armor. Let their sport fighters. Keep going, guys. Keep going. We're not even done doing this stuff yet. Actually, I probably should have sent you guys down here. How big are these guys? They are not that big, so we might be actually able to hold out here, maybe against these guys. No extra planes to talk of. Go ahead and stop training. Please stop training. Please, please, please. How is this looking? Anyone at 100%? Wasteland pacification? Good. Hang out. Sporadic outpost. Wasteland pacification. We're still waiting. That's totally fine. We have enough infantry armor. That's looking nice. That's not looking too bad either. Good stuff all around, my friends. Good, good stuff. Get five more on there. Get, like, 20 more, 10 more, 15 more on there. That's probably the most important thing to do right now. On the Enclave Technician, so Mason Salvatore's plans have finally come to fruition. In a night of extreme, supreme violence and bloodshed, hundreds of former Enclave personnel slaughtered his rivals in New Reno, butchering each of the great families. Unfortunately for Salvatore, though, the Enclave never intended to keep him around past his point, and his own organization also found himself itself on the firing line. Sergeant Dornan, the meanest man to grace the wasteland, has taken control of Reno. This time will tell, though, as to whether or not this is part of a bigger plan. We leave our own faction, but we create the Nevada Enclave, in which people don't like that. We've got advanced power schematics, plasma weaponry, and we become advanced with advanced servos, scavenged power armor, and simple servos. Nevada Core, beautiful. But you're not as good as our biggies. Enclave infantry, I think not. Biggies are where it's at. Cool. We could take some precautions though. New Reno gets some outposts, radar stations. That might actually be worth doing now, but I want to get that research slot. So, Sanctuary City. Reno is a prosperous city, and often we find the disfranchise of the wasteland at our gates. Opening them up for Sanctuary City would cause an influx of population, but may present other opportunities. We might be able to get them addicted to gambling and alcohol and prostitution. What could be better than that? Beautiful. I kind of want to do that, but let's see. Who do we have? Ooh, Krager. More stability in war sport immediately. That's actually kind of nice. Lunatic Ted. Raul. Nice. Technician. Nice. I love that guy. That looks really good. Uh, Granite would be pretty good to do. Uh, Snooky. More max entrenchment. That is something we got to get right now. And let's start building more civilian factories. Power armor breakthrough and hardness. I like that too, but I want to build. 
Uh, stability and war support, that will help us on defense if we get attacked, and that gives us more political power. Let's do that one, that's fine. And Quentin Barks is no longer here. I forget what he was doing. Oh, we need this one too. So, just in case, we might get attacked right now. Which is why I'm waiting. Because they, they had that little event in which they don't like us, so. So, volunteers, just by war goal. If I justify on them. Yeah, I've done this before, so it, you might as well just do this next. We just might as well. But, Star Wars Clear on the White Legs, okay, not us. Really wait for planes. Really have to wait for the. Oh, and more power armor. Close air support's looking really nice, too. Good, and we actually have one level fort around the entire area here. Not bad, not bad. Which gives us a little bit of a fallback line. Not much of a fallback line, but a little bit of a fallback line. We've just finished the last. Last fort. Beautiful. Build, 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 build. We have spare close air support. I don't think so, son. I don't think we're gonna have any spare close air support. But first, looting the Sierra Sierra Depot. The Sierra Army Depot holds armaments and treasures unimaginable. Having a designated team look at looting the de depot would create a steady import of armaments to the mobster families of Reno. Good stuff, my friends. Good, good stuff. Star Wars Annex. Come on, the last time I became the Enclave, you guys declared war on me. Literally, the Western Brotherhood did declare war on me, which made me kind of pissed off, but you know what? That's just me. Still got more civilian factories, get more of this, come on. And that's why we're just flying on them right now. You guys can probably go ahead and train for now. Everyone else, we can kind of hang out real quick. Too bad you can't buy power armor. That'd be kind of weird. Could you, could you imagine if we could actually buy power armor? Um, like guns. That'd be kind of wild, not gonna lie. That's kind of wild to think about. That'd be kind of cool. Just casually stroll up with a 10,000 caps. I'd like one suit of power armor, please. Damn low, good. Heaven Gate. Yep, we missed one. They don't really want to fight me yet. Strange. Why do, do I intimidate you? Come on, guys. Uh, send out these guys. Do we not have enough power armor? That's probably why. Anything here? Not really. You get a better discount. That's not bad. Basic weaponry, though. Fuel injections. I like injecting stuff. Let's do that. Nice. Keep building, keep building. And let's take a look at our occupied territories. Governor Archdonan. Wasteland, pacification, 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 pacification. That's fine, that's fine. Good. Slowly maybe getting a little bit more manpower back, too. Because of our efforts. And we're only on 10%, two-year conscription, recruitable, population, Factorino. Oh, look at, they're really beating the side up. I don't like that. 80s join the Empire Salt. That does not sound good for us. Let's go do that, too. Pioneer kits. Good. Special Forces Platoon, Armor, Land Out Attack. Miles do like to get to the next side there. Yeah, they've got a lot of divisions over here. What over here? Are they okay? Uh, I'm actually going to shift you guys this way, then. I'm going to put you in the center of the line. That should be okay. They don't really seem that strong over here. They did kill off all of the resistance, so... 9,000 manpower, 62 to 79. Really, the Desert Rangers have more divisions, more manpower, probably. Or at least more divisions. Good, and let's grab the Sierra Army Depot. Uh, excavation time. Converting the Sierra Army Depot, Sierra Depot looting to a full-scale excavation would take some manpower, but ultimately the pre-war secrets of the army base are too valuable to ignore. We could glean much insight from the depot. Absolutely. 5,000 manpower? Never enough. Never, never, never. Oh, and actually, let's do this. Military theorists for more daily army XP gain, because we could still use that. Yeah, with us d dug in, is it nice? It's going to be really nice. Oh, we don't have enough planes yet. Oh, come on. More planes. This is going to be one terrible war. Mm -hmm. Bunker. A bunker might be worth it. How long would it take to do that? Total 26. A few weeks. You know, we could do a bunker. Not against the Brotherhood, because that'll be fine. But let's make sure that we're still building up uh, at least one civilian factory. Always be building. Cool. Two more. Here we go. Good. We don't need this stuff. Nope. Fake news. 
Scavenger turned turn triumphant, and we get a bonus to robotics. A beautiful thing. White Legs, new Kanan. That is not good. The 80s and the White Legs have joined forces. That is extremely strong. S almost scarily strong. Santa Ana. Lone Trees joined the Great Confederation. I might have done the same thing. If I were them. Anything else we can do here? Not too much. That extra research slot will pay off, though. And we go to for Bridgeport, but let's not do that yet. We're not really quite ready, but we'll go to war with them by October 2nd. Hopefully by then we'll have maybe an extra plane or three, please? Please? Nice. And that's actually pretty good. I'm going to throw you on this group, though. Battle targeting point stuff. Some more suppression is always just so good to get. Guns looking great. Infantry armor looking great, just in case. Fire teams. Really not using fire teams in this campaign, but we got more recon. I should probably improve recon, too. Recon can be extremely valuable. Uh, that guy falls ill. That's fine. Whatever. Doesn't really matter. Vehicles, that's fine. Sell some outdated equipment. Get some more relations with the black market. Get another division on the center of the line, because that's going to get hit the hardest, probably. And good. 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 Next up, Chop Chop. Van Graf expansion. Let's do that one. So allowing the Van Graf family to expand their operations and energy weapon dealing would bring in even more money in a dangerous place like New Reno. People deserve such a little protection. A fifth research slot. Some of that. And you know what? We're going to end this episode by going to war. Well, guys, this is going to be crazy, but hope you enjoyed today's episode. If you did, consider leaving a like. Subscribe if you're new. Check out my Discord link in the description below, and I'll see you all tomorrow as we're going to struggle against the Western Brotherhood of Steel. Thanks for watching. Have a great rest of your day.